welcome back to my channel y'all know me i'm at work like always i'm tired and um working a 13 hour shift tonight something i don't want to do i'm down two hours i got what 11 hours to go it's, the wind blowing pretty hard too. I hope it ain't affecting y'all hearing me or whatever. Wanted to, what I really came on here for though was to thank y'all so much. I reached my goal, y'all. I reached my wash time hours. I'm there. You know. I did that. <laughs> now y'all y'all did that. Thank y'all so much. I didn't even think y'all was that interested in my little channel. But y'all be watching. Thank y'all so much. Y'all got me to my goal. I passed my thousand subscribers. I thought I was going to stop. You know. I'm still going. We about to hit 2K. You know, on the road to 2K. You know what I mean? Y'all get me to 2K. You know, if you see this. If it's going through your feed. You know, subscribe to your girl. Show your girl some love. Show your girl some love. Y'all not like that. Anyway. <laughs> you know, I'll give y'all a little glimpse of my life. It ain't much. Because my little life is not exciting. You know. But if you like to see it, I will, you know, give you a little glimpse. Not a lot. Just a teeny weeny bit. You know what I'm saying? Then we're going to make it twerk. To make it work like. <laughs> y'all see I got my phone up high because I told y'all that double neck. I'm sick of it. And it's like when I be having my phone down, you really can see it. I'm tired of it. So we're going to make it look a little. I need a face lift. A chin lift. I'm tired of this chin, y'all. I'm going on a diet this week. This the week. I know I said last week. I said last week. I'm going to... right, this the week. This going to be the week right here. Don't say nothing. Shut up. This the week. Because I said it's the week. This the week. We going on the diet. <laughs> but anyway. I just thank y'all so much for getting me to my goal, y'all. I really appreciate that. And You know, who knows where my little channel may go. We might shoot through the roof. You know, who knows? I'm going to keep on coming, you know, keep on bringing y'all some good content. You know, I like to go to museums and stuff like that, you know, places around in my area, show y'all different things. I just like to do everything. I'm just glad y'all like it, you know. I'm just glad y'all enjoy it. Seems like y'all enjoying it, but, you know, thank you. Thank y'all. And y'all know I support whoever support me. It's, it don't stop. It don't stop. We support each other, baby. This channel gonna support your channel. If I see one uh, one comment on my video, I'm going to your channel. I don't even care if you got no subscribers. I'm hit. I'm gonna be that one subscriber. That's just how I am. I don't know what it is in me. It's just in me. I just love to help people. I appreciate people helping me, but you know I love to help people. I love to help people, and it's free, y'all. You ain't doing nothing but clicking a button. We can help. all stick together. And just subscribe to each other's channels. I got so many people I'm subscribed to. I can't even count. It's over 5,000. They just me, though. I just love to help people. You know, one subscriber can help you. You never know where they may take you, you know. Because I need help. You know, it's just me. Well, it was just me. <laughs> hmm, my honey deal. But anyway. Hi, bye. I just wanted to bring y'all to work with me. And I'm going to show y'all what it's like to work 13-hour shift at a construction site. Well, let's go. What I tell y'all, I've been here two hours already. So, yeah, it's time for me to check in. Let me check in. I have to check in every hour to let them know that I'm alive and breathing. And, yeah, that's how it goes. So, we're going to roll. I'm going to check in. And I'll be back to y'all in a few minutes. And I'm going to show y'all what I do next. It really ain't nothing. I just sit and watch. But... We're going to make some stuff, you know. <laughs> I'm going to show you. <laughs> okay, y'all. So, the first thing I'm going to show y'all is how the construction site kind of, most of all of them look like this. So, I got to use the bathroom, y'all. And what I have to do when I use the restroom, something I dread doing. But, it's the only way I have to, the only way I can be. I can't leave the site, so I have to use these hold on so i have to use the porta potties guys this is how i go to the restroom 
<laughs> yeah, I hate to do it with that so you can see how clean it is. They normally clean. Okay. This one is uh, not that bad. So I take my tissue and they give us hand sanitizer and all that. So <clears throat> this is not the cleanest one I've been in, but yeah, it, it's clean enough, you know. Enough for me to do my little, I don't sit on the toilet top. Uh, I'll squat and use it. Uh, I'm not going to open it and show y'all what's in there. It's normally clean though, because it's not a lot of people uh, that use these porta potties. But what I do is take my tissue. It's always clean tissue. And if I have to sit down, if I have to go number two, then I will, you know, line my I line it around the toilet, like, you know, lift it up. I'm not gonna show y'all the inside, but yeah. I would lift the top up, line it, and sit down and go, you know, do my number two. And it don't flush, so everything goes into the floor, which is horrible to think about, but you know, we all gotta use the restroom. It's just a human thing, so. I'm about to pee. <laughs> I know that's TMI, but I gotta pee, so. And I will be right back to show y'all what I do next. All right. Oh, I want to show y'all too. They um, also have locks on the door. So if you're afraid somebody's going to try to come in, you do have a lock on the door. So, yeah. You can close that latch. You can open it and close it. And these are on most uh, construction sites. Yeah. Got plenty of tissue. Uh, sometimes it's new rolls. Yeah. But I keep tissue in my car, so we good on the tissue. But yeah, they do have locks. You can flip it up and lock. This is unlock and that is lock. All right, I'll be right back, y'all. Uh, another thing I had wanted to say was if you are doing security uh, at a construction site, bring plenty of water. I usually bring like two big jugs of water with me so I can have plenty of water in case they don't have uh, sanitizer in the bathroom. I bring sanitizer and water I use one jug to wash my hands after I use the rest of them and the other one I use for drinking water. So, be mindful of that. Yeah. So, yeah. I had to just shine my boots up today. So, if I'm not mistaken, <laughs> these apartments had went, um, well, they had, they having a little controversy with the neighbors here. Uh, if these the apartments, I think this is, because it's, I ain't saw, um, no other apartments on the news that, you know, so close to, uh, that's so close to some, uh, uh housing or uh, residents or whatever. So, let me tell y'all what I heard. Don't tell nobody. Don't tell nobody what I'm about to tell y'all. <laughs> so, supposedly, these apartments right here that they building are going to be 
uh, low income apartments. They are gonna accept section eight and they are gonna accept, you know, vouchers, housing vouchers from different uh, housing companies or whatever, you know, low income. So the neighbors here in these beautiful houses right here, they ain't happy. So I remember, um, I remember like a few months ago, seeing this on the news. <laughs> I saw it on the news. They covered it, and um, they were saying that um, the neighbors weren't happy. Y'all see that Look, big, beautiful houses? You see that back there? Those big, beautiful houses right there. Them people is a little unhappy. So they don't want these apartments to come here. But they already breaking ground, so they it's too late now. So they, you know, they gonna have to learn to live, you know. So these apartments that's going up right here, they about to be low income. I know exactly what this is. Yep, I saw the story on the news, y'all. It was bad. The neighbors was talking real. <laughs> they was talking reckless, y'all. They don't want these apartments over here. But it's too late. Ain't nothing they can do about it, you know. But just pray, you know, good people come over here. So with that being said, yeah, um, Y'all got some new neighbors. <laughs> y'all got some new neighbors. And everybody gone. I was just checking y'all doing my little rounds. Making sure everybody was gone. So it's about to get dark. I'm about to go sit up front. I'm not going to be in here riding around like this. I'm not doing this no more. This is the only time I'm doing this. I'm not looking for the criminals. And I hope the hell they ain't looking for me. So I'm going to be sitting up front. Up here by this grocery store. <laughs> Nothing more. Nothing less. <laughs> like my good Diara say. Nothing more. Nothing less. Yeah, we're going to be up front here. And I'll be back in a couple hours, y'all. Because this video going to be stupid long. If I keep talking. Well, yeah. It's 7.26 p.m. And I'll probably hit y'all back up about 10 o'clock tonight. And we'll see what it's looking like out here. Because this is my first night. I don't know what the lighting is like or none of this. So... We gonna see. I'll see y'all at 10. All right. Bye. Okay, y'all. It's almost 9 o'clock. So I came back a little early. But I just want y'all to see how it looks. It's dark. The lights, it's like no light over there. But it's lights behind me, as y'all can see. It's a store and stuff back there. You know, some neighborhood right there. But yeah. It can get a little spooky, y'all. So it still looks a little spooky. But I just locked my doors and cut off all my lights and I begin this time. But let me show y'all what it look like in front of me. Sun is all the way down. Let me show y'all. So that is what it looks like right before dark, y'all. It's not all the way dark yet, but it's about to be nine o'clock. Like I said, it's like eight forty-six. It get completely dark at about nine thirty here in Oklahoma. So yeah, that is how it's looking. Um, yeah, I'm about to go into complete darkness in a few minutes here. So, I'll show y'all what it looks like when it gets completely dark. And what kind of lights is around me. Alright, I'll be back. Alright, y'all. So, basically, I already went up. Uh, like I said, I'm going to stay down here at the end of the road. I'm not going back up there by myself and sitting. Uh, but, I already went. I'm not going to see back there. It's pitch black back there. I'm not going to sit up there. So, I'm just swing this around so y'all can see but i do have my um flashlight and when i go up this is my flashlight y'all that i got if y'all can see that this is it i'm trying to show y'all i ain't gonna cut my light on because i'm i don't even know about no female they be thinking a man in this truck and it's good you know keep thinking it but yeah oh this is my flashlight i'm gonna show y'all how it shines it shines very bright so if you can see it it shines over way over there to that in that field so yeah it shines pretty far if y'all can see that it shines a long way i've been had this light for about a year when i bought my i had well about almost two years because when i bought my uh sequoia it was actually inside of it so yeah it shines pretty bright y'all you see there it is so yeah I just want to show y'all that. And let me get back to looking. I'll be back in a little while. It's 10 o'clock now, y'all. So 
uh, going on 11 o'clock. So the night is going. I've been here, what, almost six hours now. <laughs> and I peed once I got to pee again. I'm not going back up there. I'm going to use the bathroom at the grocery store. So, yeah, you're not supposed to leave post, but if you just have to leave the post, you can, as long as you're going close by to the restroom. So, yeah, my boss, he pretty cool about that. Let me go to the restroom somewhere close around. So, yeah, we're going to go to the restroom in the store. Because I'm not going back in the dark. <laughs> yes. So, I'll be back, y'all, in a couple hours. All right. All right, y'all. So, y'all see how it's looking. And there we go. Pitch dark out here. You have to shine the light around. Make sure you see. It's 3.30 a.m. in the morning. And I'm just checking it out. All right, we're going to drive along. straight ahead. Those are the houses I was telling you about earlier. The houses. Stay on for about an hour. After I leave from back here, I stay on for an hour. So that's a good thing. That's a little better. Thank you. 